Hi, this is Eric Martin with Board Game Geek. I'm here with Kurt Covert from Smirk and Dagger Games, looking at paramedics. Clear! I guess you have to say That's pretty much like, like that, yeah. Like that, okay. <laughs> um, by designer Gary Kagan, and I don't know anything about this game, so. So, this is um, kind of an unusual game for us in that when people first play it, they're not going to immediately get the backstabby feel which they come to expect from us. Okay. That comes That's with experience your... in the game. Okay. Once you get really good, you've got time because this is a pulse pounding, high tension game of saving lives against the clock with the clock time and you're running down, and you're probably not going to be able to save them all. Okay. So, but it is not cooperative. It is not cooperative. It is a competitive game. There's not game. much backstabby in a cooperative game. So. Well, correct. All right, all right. So, so. Okay. So how does how does it work? So, with, with so what you're doing, you've got uh, you've got patients that uh, you, your paramedic is going to find. Now, all of them have medical needs, as you'll see. Okay. Um, so, each patient has to have at least one life-saving uh, medical supply given to them um, during the turn, or they're going to die. Okay. So the way you do that, it is a bit of, bit of resource management. So, uh, for example, your chart on this card shows what cards you need from your supply. This guy needs blood, for example. So, two yellow on my chart says he c I can make a blood. Okay. Now I can give that to him, and he is sustained for the round. He will not die. You gave him some attention. Yes. Okay. Now, this guy, he needs a pill. So I, that's an orange, and I happen to have one. So, sustained. Okay. Now, does each player have their own board? Or yes, you, everyone has their this? own board, and okay. you're going one at a time. And you're doing that on a 60-second turn for the first round. Okay. Um, at the same time, you're trying to upgrade your rig. You're trying to transport people to the hospital because they are worth points if you actually save them, get them to the hospital. And if you lose them, if you can't save them in time, then uh, they're negatives against your score. Okay. Yeah. Um, and your... what's kind of interesting is, so let's let's say I'm able to save this this patient. That's right. Send him to the hospital. If my main gurney is open, I must draw immediately two new patients, triage them. With the time left and the supplies I have left, what who can I actually save? I'll try this guy. But you know now I've only got ten seconds left, and he still needs to be sustained. Right. But you can throw this out here for some bandages. Right. Right, sustained, uh, call it out, and yes. then, yeah, you're off to the races. But it might be a critical. Now, a critical, unlike being able to save over turns, has to be completely saved in one turn or okay. he dies. All right. Now, those turns end up going from 60 seconds down to 45, down to 30 seconds in the in the third round. So it is just constantly a, a, a churn where you're like, oh, oh my god. And uh, and yeah, that when, when the timer is running down, when you've saved everyone and done everything you can for the turn and that success, clear! And then you immediately start it for the next player and you're, you're off to the races again. I don't know if you can see this, but this yeah. is kind of where that timer's yeah. at. Yeah, so that's what it's going to look like. So that is going to be a companion app, okay. free download. Um, and if for some reason you don't have it, you know, when you first peel off the wrap, that's fine. Uh, any any digital timer or stopwatch will work. So right. anything will be fine. Okay, as long as you do the shifting time for right, sixty, forty-five, rounds. and thirty. Yeah. Okay. All right, uh, and one to four players, I see. One to four players, um, and it is coming out for August for Gen Con. Okay. Um, and as I said. This game, um, because you're so focused on your turn, and it's so rapid fire, until you get good, you won't see the opportunities to mess with other people, but they do exist. You can deny people supplies by, you know, taking, there's a common pool of, of supply cards you can always swap into, okay. and if I see you're working on a patient that needs something on your chart, the last minute I can swap in cards, okay. you know, and, and deprive you of resources. So, That's right. Yeah. Very, very competitive. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, doctor is here. Yeah. All right. So, well, there we go. Yeah. Overview of paramedics. Clear. I was less enthusiastic that time. Yeah. Clear! <laughs> okay.